Yummy Chicken Samosa. Hello Unique Lovers, welcome back. Thank you for tuning in. Today, I will be sharing with you how to make Yummy Chicken Samosa from beginning to the end. This is super yummy. As a first timer, this is very important to you because I will show you how to wrap samosa in two different ways. Okay, let's go. In a saucepan, add in oil. Allow it to heat a bit. Add in minced chicken and steam fry it. Then sieve out the water. Hello, after watching this video, if you have any question, drop it in the comment section and I will be there to answer you. Now the chicken is okay, I will strain out the water, then set the chicken aside. In another saucepan, add in oil, allow it to heat a bit. Add in minced ginger and garlic. Then stir fry it for 40 seconds. Add in onion and stir fry it for 1 minute. Once done, add in the chicken, mixed veggies, seasoning powder or cube, salt, coriander, cumin, paprika, white pepper and black pepper. Then stir fry it until it is well dry. Hi, if you are new here, I want to specially thank you for clicking on this video. Please don't forget to subscribe, turn on the notification bell to be notified whenever I upload a new video. Like, comment and share this video with your family and friends. To my returning subscribers, I appreciate you all for always coming back to watch. Thank you for your kind support. Hello, once the chicken is well dry, transfer it inside a bowl and set it aside. In another bowl, add in flour. Add in water, then mix it, as you can see in this video. Once done, set it aside. Then get your tray or kneading board. Now let's wrap the samosa. Get your pastry. Place it on top of the kneading board or tray, then fold it to get the shape. Then open it and cut it into two. Use knife or scissor to cut it. Once done, place one on top of each other just to get the exact line. Then apply the flour mixture. Then close it back. Make sure that it's closed very well. Once done, make a V shape with the pastry. Just wash very well as you can see in this video. Use one finger to hold each end when you want to fold it so that you can get the exact shape. Just look how it is in this video very well. If you did not fold it very well, the possibility of it to lose inside the oil is there. But once you get it, you will fry your samosa without any error. Then fill it with the fried chicken and wrap it as you can see in this video. At the end of the wrapping, apply the flour mixture to hold it very well. Wash out the way I am doing it. Do yours the same way. Hello, how did you see it? It is very nice, right? So make yours this way. This is the first set. This is another shape or how you will wrap your samosa again. This, make it V-shape. Don't put it to the end. Make it halfway as you can see in this video. 
Also place your finger, then cross each other. Then put one, the one on top, put it inside. But don't let the, the chicken mixture to be on top of it. Fill it with the mixture. Use the top pastry to cover it inside and then use the remaining back side to cover it. Then apply the floor mixture and cover it very well. If there is any space, apply the floor mixture and cover it very well. Repeat this shape, any one of your choice, until you finish wrapping. This is very easy for the beginners. Hello, where are you watching from? Let me know in the comment section so that I can send you a hug in my next video. Today's special hug goes to Kate watching from Abuja, Nigeria. I'm glad you love my recipe. Thank you for watching. Hi, if you are still watching and you haven't hit the subscription button, hello, this is the rightful time for you to do so. Please subscribe. Turn on the notification bell to be notified whenever I upload a new video. Like, comment and share this video with your family and friends. Please do this to support me to help me grow my channel. Thank you for your kind support. After wrapping, in a hot oil, place in the wrapped samosa and deep fry it. Fry it until it turns to golden brown. Then remove it from the hot oil and place it on a tray light up with kitchen towel to remove excess oil if there is any one. Repeat this method until you finish frying your samosa. Hello, the yummy chicken samosa is ready and all that is left is to serve and enjoy. So I am inviting you all to come and enjoy this yummy samosa with me. Okay, if you are still watching until this moment, that means you love what I am doing. Thank you for staying with me till the end of this video. Please don't forget to subscribe. Turn on the notification bell to be notified whenever I upload a new video. Like, comment, and share this video to your family and friends. May God Almighty bless you all. Thank you for watching. Thank you for liking. Thank you for commenting. Thank you for sharing. See you guys in my next video. Bye.